Hello Blues fans, we stand in the bowels of Westpac Stadium here in Wellington, New Zealand for this very special of Anzac Day matches against the Saints. My name's Sam Edmund, of course, joining me to my right is none other than Norm Smith, medalist, Carlton Premiership hero, David Rhys-Jones. And uh, of course, Johnny Barker as well. JB, we'll start with you. A late change has been a bit happening. Tuddy's out, Matthew Dick's in, and Reese presented him with his jumper, and Blaine Bokhorst is in as well, and those two will make their AFL debuts. Yeah, really exciting. Always exciting when you get... Uh De debutants in and um, we know Blaine's going to give us plenty of run and, and uh, really good ball use and, and Tuddy's obviously come out of the Sydney system and he's a solid citizen and we're looking forward to him having a strong game. Can you tell us a bit about Michael Jamison who uh, was a bit touch and go right up until the last minute but he's obviously good to go past a late fitness test? Yeah look he's a little bit tight and um, but got through the fitness test okay and he'll line up. And the significance of Anzac Day being over here in New Zealand, uh, who we fought alongside, uh, mixed big on his history. Um, is, is much of the Anzac spirit type stuff coming out with that? Yeah, look, we've touched on that. We had uh, Ben Robert Smith come uh, into the club a couple of weeks ago, and he, look, he was, just had some outstanding messages and themes for for the group. Uh, a few of us went to the dawn service this morning, which was pretty special, and, and Mick touched on um, the significance of the day. Uh, just before we left the hotel. So, look, it's a big day um, from an Australian and New Zealand point of view and, and we're very happy to be a part of it. And last week against Essen, we showed a bit more fight and, um, and, and, and pretty, pretty good over the, over the course of the day. Didn't get the result we wanted, but um, not a bad effort. Well, well, look, we'd like to think that that's the standard of effort, of effort we need to give week in, week out and for four quarters. And, and from that point in... From that point, you can actually grow your game. So uh, we're expecting the boys to play full four-quarter effort today and, and um, hopefully we can get over the line. And St Kilda being a young team um, and, and, and a little bit of an experience out there, how are we going to attack them and how are we going to beat them? Well, look, we, we need to dominate the midfield. We know that, uh, you know, basing on some of the things that come out of their game against Collingwood and the Gold Coast Suns. We know they're going to apply a lot of pressure, so we've got to be really sharp with the ball. Uh, but... It's a little bit of a shorter ground, so we know centre square bounce is going to be critical today as well. It's a small ground, JB. Contested stuff. We've been good in that area, no mm. Juddy, but you'd think we'd have we'd have a stronghold in that particular aspect. Oh, look, we're we're pretty keen to get a get a stranglehold in that area, no doubt. And um, you know, it all starts in the middle, as we said. Well, we've had everything here in Wellington, from turbulent flights to earthquakes. Let's hope the next four quarters are a little bit smoother. We'll see you back here after the final sorrow.